Matt, welcome to Celtic. You're here, you've, you've had a look round. How does it feel? Feels amazing. Um, first time taking the stadium in, even better than I thought it would be. And um, yeah, just to put it simply, just, just really, really happy to be a massive club and really excited to get going. When the manager spoke to you about the possibility of, of coming here, I know you had options elsewhere. What were your first impressions? Yeah, I mean, there, there were other options. Um, ones that I thought were the only ones before Selwick and then Selwick kind of came out of the blue, to be fair. Kind of found out quite, quite late and um, had a phone call with Ange and he came across really, really well. And he was the one that really sold me. You know, obviously the club itself is massive, but just speaking to him really, really just sorted it out for me. Um, and yeah, I think with the style he plays and all that that surrounds it, him as a person, as soon as I, honestly, as soon as I got off the phone, I was, I was ready to come, to be honest. You do know some people who have been connected with the club as well. Peter Grant, your, your old coach, of course, is a, is a legend here back in the, the 80s. But Stefan Johansson, a player you know well, and I believe you went to school with Patrick Roberts. I did, I did. So um, Peter Grant coached me during my time at Fulham in the 23s. Um, really nice guy, really nice guy. And he, he helped me develop quite a lot of my time at Fulham. Um, Pat, I went to school with, went in the same car to school. He's a little bit older than me, but at the time he was actually someone I looked up to within Fulham. Um, he was doing really well at the time, so that's another one for the storybooks. Um, and the last one, Steph. Obviously, I got to know Steph really well. He's Norwegian. I've obviously got a bit of Norwegian in me, but Danish as well. So we got on in that sense. And um, obviously, I'm, I'm good mates with all of them, but just shows that a club like Celtic can attract people like Steph, like Pat, like Peter, of course. And it's just nice to follow the same routes as such. Coming through at Fulham and then, of course, at, at MK Dawn, Celtic is a big s step up. You see the stadium, the you know, 60,000 fans in here. It's going to put you on the big stage, going to make you noticed by a lot more people. Yeah, that's what I want. That's what I want as a player. That's why one of the main reasons I came here was, was the fan base, the size of the club. You know, um, just the thought of playing even in front of like 40,000 40, sounds like a lot to me. So um, the fact that it's even close to 60 is pretty incredible and something I'm really excited for. You said you'd spoken to the manager. I'm sure you've, you've watched Celtic recently and seen the kind of style of attacking football that, that we play. Does that fit into your own style? Yeah, that's another thing that was massive in terms of my decision to come here. Um, I always said I wasn't just going to join a club if they paid me a certain amount of money, if the style wasn't right. I'm not that, not that kind of guy. Um, the style is right here, of course, and that, that's, again, one of the main reasons why, why I've come. And Ange said to me on the phone, of course, we want to win. We, the expectation is to win, but win the right way, win playing proper football. And that, that's what I came here to do. You're still very young in your early 20s, but you've, you've worn the captain's armband at, at MK Dons. Do, a club like Celtic needs as many leaders as it can get throughout the dressing room. Yeah, of course. Um, to be honest, I wouldn't say I'm, I'm the loudest guy. I probably won't be the guy that shouts at everybody. Um, but I do try to take responsibility on the pitch through how I play. I'll never shy away from getting on the ball, etc., stuff like that. And obviously not afraid to use my voice when I need to, but I try to lead through how I play and how I act as opposed to, you know, the more of the, the loud type. Well, listen, it's great to have you here, Matt. Welcome to Celtic. Thanks very much.